Welcome back my children to another Mortal Kombat X video. I will be continuing the Dragon Breath Baratra Challenge and Elder Difficulty. I've done stages 1 through 4 and for the 5th stage you must have Reptile and Cassie Cage on your team. I keep forgetting that her name is Cassie Cage, not Casey Cage. Anyways, I'm going to be using Strike Force Johnny Cage, Ra Classic Reptile and Cover Ops Cassie Cage. Now I did give her equipment earlier but i don't know what happened to them it wasn't so long ago it was like a couple of minutes ago but anyways i'm gonna give them back um what were they again i kind of forgot okay power glove and then soul medallion there we go so i'm gonna be using only these three characters you c aside from uh, reptile and cassie cage you're able to use any other character could you be anybody and I'm choosing Strike Force Johnny Cage. And yeah, anyways, I'm gonna start. So I'm gonna be using all three, these three, for all 30 matches. Strike Force Johnny Cage is very fast to attack, so that's why I chose him. And he's strong. Plus, uh, quite recently, I got him to rank 9, so he's definitely much stronger than before. So for the last match, which which is Dragon Breath Baracho, um, if you guys didn't know, um, whenever you do face him, he um, gets immune to a class that you're battling him with. So if I start the match with Strike Force Johnny Cage, he's gonna get immune to Spec Ops, and you're not gonna be able to be able to damage him at all with with a Spec Ops. You definitely need to use another class so that w that's why um, I'm assuming that's why they made it a different class which is reptile and Cassie Cage they're different classes reptile is always outworld and Cassie Cage is always in spec, up, spec ops and they give you a third option to choose a different class I guess luckily but yeah so once I do start the match with Johnny Cage He's going to get me on two spec ops and I'm going to have to switch to Reptile to continue um, damaging him. But then he's going to become immune to um, to our worlds. So I'm going to have to go and switch back to to Johnny Cage to defeat Boracho. For the uh, for stages 4 and 5 you can only use spec ops and i thought that they were gonna take away the the um the modifier to um so that uh Boracho could get get defeated with only spec ops but it's still active so what i had to do i had to use strike force johnny cage um who else oh i gave him the wrath hammer which gives him a bar of power at the beginning and I also used balanced Kenshi which gives back ups one bar of power at the start so I ended up using strike for Johnny Cage's second special right away to defeat Boracho for uh, stages 4 and 5 but yeah so you would think they would take away the modifier since you only get to use spec ups only, but they don't. They make it harder for you. But luckily, my I have very strong characters, basically, especially spec ups. There we go. I think this is the sixth battle. I'm not quite sure. I haven't been really paying attention properly. Yeah, so I'll recharge again. So that's why I like Strike for Johnny Cage a lot. Especially for Elder difficulties. Because he attacks quick and he's powerful. Because other characters, um, basic attacks are a little slower. So I like how the way he attacks. Oh, great. Stupid uh, Tremor had to bring out Kazi Cage. Who is the weakest out of all of them? John Cage again and defeat it very nice 
All right. Next match. I realized that the previous Elder difficulty, which was for, um, who was the character? Kind of forgot. Um, oh, um, it was Flaming Fist Liu Kang. He was the previous challenge for the el Elder difficulty. I don't remember if I used Drag for Johnny Cage, but um, the recording. Yeah, the recording lasted only 30 minutes, so that was great. So I'm going to try doing the same for this one. I like it when I take less than 30 minutes for the Elder difficulty. Because it's 30 matches, so the matches tend to be pretty long. So I try to make it as less time as possible. To not waste too much time, of course. There we go, now for Kenshi. Awesome. So I really like short and quick matches. Also, my cats are meowing. Well, not all of them, just one. There we go. One more, and defeat it. See, very quick and easy with uh, Johnny Cage. He's definitely one of my favorite spec ops. Especially for the diamonds. He's definitely the best. There we go. Now for Kitana. Very nice. Okay, next match. Getting closer to the 30th match. It's taken a while though. Damn it. Come on, defeat him. There we go. Oh, great. There we go. Oh, great. Tremor brings out Cassie Cage once again. Alright. Oh, I could have used her second special, but whatever. There we go. He's defeated. Alright, continue, recharge, and continue. Starting off with Jackie Briggs. Melina and Scorpion. Very quick. next match after the next match it's only 15 left there we go now for Tanya and Ermac very cool four dozen coins also, I was down to a couple days, days ago, I believe, maybe last week. I was down to way less than four, 400,000 coins because, because I ended up using them. And now I'm back to 3 million. It's so easy to gain a lot of coins, for me at least, because of the towers, the challenges. What else do I do? The, uh, what's it called? The quest? The quest mode? And then, uh, the packs and whatnot. Everything. 
so much coins. Oh, and whenever I get duplicate items that I already have maxed, that gives me coin coins as well. So it's very easy for me to get coins. Oh, stupid little king, get defeated. There we go. All right. Come on, hurry up. Next match. All right. There's a Hellspawn Scorpion. He's one of the characters I would like to rank up more. I have him at like rank five at the moment. Kind of forgot. Five or six, one of those. There we go. Also, we got uh, yesterday, we got a diamond character for free for Christmas. Um, it was only out of all the MK11 characters, and I got MK11 um, Cabal. Which I think he's a new character now that I think about it. I generally forgot to check on him after I got him, so I think I haven't leveled him up or anything. I think I should do that later. Because I know for sure I had the, um, what was, it, what was his name? Black Dragon um, Cabal, I believe. Let me just quickly check. He should be all the way at the back. Yeah, there we go. I got MK11, MK11 Cabal. He's the newest character I got. Newest um, diamond character. And there's a Black Dragon Cabal. So I have both of the Cabals already now. Yeah, I'm gonna get his um, passive maxed. There we go. And I'll just quickly do the first special. Nice. And there. I'll level him up later. Anyways, I'm gonna continue. So yeah, that was my free diamond character for Christmas from yesterday. Hopefully you all were able to claim your free diamond characters. Well, character, not characters, character. There we go. All right, next match. Okay, it seems like there's only 10 matches left, which is great. I wanted to finish already. Defeat it. Defeat it. And now for Triborg. Oh, great. Oh my goodness, I gotta be careful. And defeat it. Very nice. Alright. Next match. Oh, first 4,500 coins. So many coins. What I need is souls. I need more souls, not coins. I still don't understand why the the fifth stage for elder difficulty doesn't give souls like the normal and hard difficulty. It really makes no sense. You should be getting souls instead of coins throughout the throughout all the floors or whatever they're called. The matches. Alright, recharge. I'm getting there. Luckily I think three times in a row when I'm when I've been doing elder difficulty. I haven't been sleepy, so I don't fall asleep during the matches, like I've done other times for the Elder difficulty. I always make sure now, from now on, not to um, feel sleepy when I'm doing the Elder difficulties. Sometimes I don't have 
a choice because I kind of forgot to record right away. But not this time. Well, I'm not going to let it happen anymore. Because then it's quite annoying having to check the parts I fall asleep and edit, edit them out. So I don't like doing that for sure. So I definitely don't want to fall asleep while doing the Elder difficulty. It just gets boring after a while. Just battling and battling. Especially since it's repetitive. But I'm quite a, I'm wide awake, so it doesn't get bo I mean, it's boring, but... You know, I just do it. And I don't fall asleep. There's more coins. Which should be souls, but for some reason the Elder difficulty instead it gives coins, not souls. I don't understand why. Oh my goodness. Alright, she used her special to defeat it. Now for Armac. And Scorpion. Okay, that did not defeat him. And he's defeated. Very nice. Alright, recharge. Next match. Gotta be careful. What the heck? Come on, get defeated. Oh, there's random tagging. Great. I didn't realize it till now. Okay, I'm gonna use my, my second special on. Never mind. Now it's Reptile. I'm gonna try to defeat him with the first special. And there we go. Nice. Okay, next match. So, um, let's see. I think two more matches and then it's the last three matches, which is great. It hasn't been so long since I started, so that's great. Really liked it, like it this way. Alright. Defeat it. Awesome. Alright, 5,000 coins. Yeah, so after this match is... Yeah, uh, three more matches after this match. So first is Classic Liu Kang. He's defeated. Now for Classic Raiden, who power drained me. But it's whatever. There we go. Damn it. And Melina is defeated. Recharged again. Next match. Starting off with Scorch Baraka. Get defeated, oh my goodness. I did not want him to attack at all. There we go. Now for Melina. Oh my goodness. And I missed. I don't like it when his uh, specials miss. But whatever. Alright, finally, after this match, is the last one. So many matches. There we go, now for Kitana. And Triborg. 
Very nice. All right, so at last, the last match. First is 15,000 coins as a reward. And last battle, the last match is the boss Dragon Breath Boracho. He's level 50 and rank um, 8. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try to defeat him with the second special or the X-ray, whichever I get first. All oh, right, that's, um, he's gonna get immune to spec ops in a bit. So I'm gonna switch to, yep, there we go. So I have to switch to reptile. If I keep attacking him when he gets immune, it's not gonna do anything. So there he gets immune, I'm gonna show, just in case you guys want to see it. He doesn't get damaged at all, so I'm gonna um, defeat him with Johnny Cage. And there. So you just have to switch back and forth between the classes, the types, whatever you want to call them. And you defeat him. So very easy. So there I got a Dragon Breath Boracho once again. I already have him maxed, so I'm getting 54 souls and 27,000 coins. And at another 100 souls. So in total, 154 souls. And there the Elder difficulty is completed. And let's check on Boracho. There he is. So he's my sixth strongest character without the Wrath Hammer. But yeah, he is a martial artist and he's pretty fat. So his first special is Ignition, it does, it does stun. His second special is High Spirit, that does weaken. And his X-Ray is Drunk, Drunken Puncture, that does cripple. And then uh, his passive is double vision. These are his stats at rank X and level 60. And his supports. I need one more of them maxed, which is rival Baraka. The other two are maxed. Master's Wrath and Spiritual Training. And I also have his, his equipment maxed. Where is it? Uh, Baracho's flask. So yeah, there's a uh, Baracho. He's very cool. And now I'll, I will have to wait for the next challenge. Not sure what, who is it going to be. But yeah, for now, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you liked the video. Comment down below what you guys think. And I'll see you guys in the next Mortal Kombat X video.